Hey what's up you guys, welcome back to my channel, if you're new here, hi, hello, I'm Lydia and if you are new here make sure you hit the subscribe button, join the growing family, my goal is to hit 10k by the end of the year, let's do this, let's work as a team. To anyone who doesn't know I make mental health videos here on YouTube through my experience, I take you along to appointments, I document my physical health, I'm a type 1 diabetic, and basically I just share every aspect of my life. <laughs> So today I thought we could talk about the hallucinations that I got when I was taking Zopiclone. Now let's do a bit of a pretext. I took Zopiclone for seven years. Yes, I'm aware that it's a very long time to be on a zine drug, but I literally couldn't sleep without it. Go to May last year, May 2023. I was in hospital, but I started having really vivid hallucinations every time I took Zopiclone. And it was only ever after I took Zopiclone. Now I'd never had a problem with Zopiclone until that point. The first night I thought it was just my medic because I hadn't had my medication for a period of time while I was waiting for a bed. But it got more and more intense. It felt like bugs were crawling under my skin. I then tried to scratch it out. But yeah, I started hallucinating. And it wasn't pleasant. I so said I felt like I had bugs crawling under my skin. Every time I lay down and close my eyes, I just start seeing these little creatures. And I'd open my eyes and they'd still be there. And it just, it was horrendous. So I couldn't sleep because I was hallucinating. And it just continued until I got put on trazodone for sleep. Because I need something to help me sleep. I've tried not taking anything to sleep and I genuinely just can't sleep. Which is why I take Trazodone. And if you didn't see my last video on Trazodone, I'll link it up there on the iCard. Because it goes over the use of Trazodone for sleep. But hallucinations are something that should be taken seriously, no matter what causes them. They're scary. You just don't know if it's real or not. The only reason I'm able to differentiate between hallucinations and reality is because when I'm on my medication, I don't hallucinate. If anyone doesn't know, I'm on haloperidol, lithium, vortioxetine, clomazepam, and trazodone. But when I'm on my medication, I don't hallucinate. And I was on my medication for some of the nights to follow the first night. I need to get to the works and pick up a pen because my favourite pen ran out of ink. So I'm going to replace it. Ooh. A video that I want to make, and I don't know if you guys want to see it, is about anxiety tics. Because I've been having a lot of them recently and I did film some. So I want to make a video on that. If you want to see it, let me know in the comments below by, and let me know by giving this video a thumbs up. So. The hallucinations were very intense. I struggled with them quite badly because I wasn't sleeping. When I don't sleep, it affects how my other medication works. But the important thing is, is it did get resolved, and now I'm on. I'm not on Zopiclone. Ah! Devil drug. I'm on Trazodone. Like I said, video will be linked up in the iCard earlier on. Sleep is important, and if you don't have a sleep schedule, your mental health will decline. I take my night meds at 8 o'clock in the evening, I'm normally asleep by 9. And I sleep right through until my, the next day. So, trust it don't work. But yeah, Zopiclone is a no-no for me now. So, if Trazodone stops working, I don't know what I'm going to do. I tried Zopidam. Sun Zambian. It didn't work for me. It did nothing. It didn't help me sleep. And I was on 10 milligrams of that, I think. It's quite a while ago now. But it, it did nothing for me. But yeah, that's all I've got for this video. If you want to hear more like, stories from the cycle ward, I guess, let me know in the comments down below. Let me know what you want to see. If you've got any video requests, let me know. I'm always open to requests. This was a request video, so hit me up. Don't forget if you want to support the channel I have a Patreon, it is linked in the description down below. I posted a video on there yesterday because YouTube took down the video. So bonus video is over on Patreon, which I will link up there. Anyway, peace.